Hey everyone, Steven here. Uh, today I'm going to cover, uh, I guess, a common problem people are having with Ad Adobe Premiere Pro. Uh, I guess this happened with the update last September, and uh, I've watched a handful of videos I was able at to actually fix mine where the audio doesn't import when you drop a, a video in. So you'll literally just have it so that there's no sound, and it doesn't even show up. Um, so I'm going to cover three possible solutions for this. Uh, so right now, I mean, my sound is... Hey guys, Steve here. Uh, just... So it's playing on this video. Uh, one is, if this is basically turned on or off, that can affect it. Um, so you have video one uh, and audio one. Basically get, getting rid of the source so it's not even there. So you might actually have to... That's turned off. You need to turn that on. That's one possible solution. Um, but, like with mine, it didn't even pop up over here because literally there was no audio on it at all. So, another thing that you can try is we're going to go here, we're going to go down to Media. Click on Media, and then you basically need to clear your cache database. So we go right here, and you just need to clean it, and then hit OK. And <clears throat> you just try to read we drop it down into uh, Adobe Premiere and see if it pops up. The last one, and this was actually my solution. We're gonna go down to here. Um, you need to type in run. Click on that. Now when you have run up, right here, you're gonna type in percentage, app data percentage, and then hit okay. Once you're there, you need to go to your Adobe file. And then right here, you're gonna see a file called common, okay? Now, right now you see two, because I have common and common old. So I guess with, like I said, the update, it made it so that basically it wasn't actually going to, it either gets, uh, from what I've heard, overwhelmed, or it basically just loses that <clears throat> link. It needs to create a new folder for it. So you type, or rename your common, right to common old okay and then hit enter and then so you won't have a common file after you do that so close this out and then when you go to redrop your video in Premiere Pro it'll create that common folder again and it's basically like a new clean version of it so it'll actually drop the audio now in Premiere Pro for you so I hope that helps anybody. Like I said, those are three options. Those are kind of the most common that I saw. If you have something that's more complex than that, I mean, just search for those YouTube videos and go on those forums and I'm sure you'll find it. Um, and you can also reach out to Adobe if it ends up being something that is far more complicated and they can help you. So if that helped, uh, I'm going to pump out more of these as they kind of pop up and uh, kind of help anybody else out there that's having problems with their PC. Uh, looking for those solutions. So thank you guys so much for watching and uh, check back next time.